So the first artist that I really fell in love with was George Rodrigue. Growing up in Louisiana, his work was everywhere. What really struck me the most, his blue dog, which I absolutely fell in love with, head over heels. Blue Dog actually came pretty late in his career. Originally, he painted all of these great scenes of life in South Louisiana. He had a dog growing up named Tiffany, supposedly that appeared to him in a dream, and then he started juxtaposing Tiffany on all these old paintings. And I actually have a collection of books that he signed for me over the years. A couple of them are not here with me today. I've loaned them to an exhibition. There's a festival in Shreveport called the Red River Rebel, and he did a series of three posters for them. It's a really, really cool. I think probably everybody that lives in Northwest Louisiana has one of these. Yeah, I have three of them. I was in high school, and I had to have them. George Rodrigue was really starting to take off. I was working for Neiman Marcus, and this was one of my favorite paintings he ever did. It was on the cover of the Neiman's book, and it was the Neiman's shopping bags uh, when they opened up their Honolulu store. The colors of the butterflies, the colors of the blue dog, the fantasy of the tropical, you know, Hawaiian setting. It's just charming. And that's what the blue dog is all about. It made George Rodrigue happy. Tiffany was his favorite dog. Anyway, see how much joy it brings you when you look at it? Just, colors just make you smile.